Hi everybody, I'm going to be talking about chapter 5, in specific Esther Thelen's theory, which is called Dynamic Systems Theory. As the book states, it is a theory of how infants assemble motor skills for perceiving and acting. In other words, how do babies learn or know how to move? You know motor skills they're reaching out walking grabbing moving their hands and legs in his theory he states that babies are goal oriented meaning that let's say they see their mom across the room they're gonna go through trial and error to get to their mom they're gonna start kicking they're gonna start you know moving what they can and discovering you know I can walk like I'm stumbling but I'm uh, this is this is getting me to my mom so they might fall they might stumble but does that stop them no they're gonna keep trying because they're teaching themselves these new motor skills it's not something that it's just you know like at six months they know how to do this no it's on a basis of problem solution they see a problem that they want to solve it so they're gonna you know learn to assess their body to help them uh, get there through like okay th my my crawling isn't helping me enough let me go ahead and get up and walk so this led me to wonder why some babies last longer in the crawling phase and why some move on so quickly to the walking phase you know they all have kind of the same goal, you know, they, they want to get to that certain spot or they're trying to reach um, something or someone. Why do they last longer in the crawling phase? And why do some just see something and, and they're like, okay, I'm going to start moving my legs and, and they walk so fast. So that's my question for this video post and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you.